Today, we come together as one nation to salute the veterans of the United States Armed Forces, the greatest warriors to ever walk the face of the earth. Donald Trump becoming the first sitting U.S. president to attend the Veterans Day parade in New York Tuesday. From behind bulletproof glass, he honored the men and women who've served and sacrificed. And to the 18 million veterans across our country, the First Lady and I have come to express the everlasting love and loyalty of 327 million Americans. While veterans were the focus of the ceremony, a reminder of the impeachment drama was nearby. In the windows of a building overlooking the park where Trump delivered his speech, signs were posted that read impeach and convict. This just days before the public phase of the impeachment inquiry into Trump begins, with televised hearings starting Wednesday. The focus of the Democrat-led probe is a July 25th phone call in which Trump asked the Ukrainian president to look into his domestic political rival Joe Biden and Biden's son. Now, the public testimony expected to be viewed by millions when it's aired on major TV networks, cable news, and expect to hear more from Donald Trump in the run-up to those public hearings on Twitter. He again is saying that call was perfect, and he adds, nothing was done wrong.